The Department of Homeland Security was created on November 25, 2002, under the Bush administration, almost a year after a terrorist attack on September 11, 2001. The reason for the creation of the Department of Homeland Security was to protect the territory of the United States from terrorist attacks and helping out to natural disasters. The department was put under its own cabinet in the United States federal government. This department is in charge of protecting all its citizens with, within its bo own borders while the Department of Defense prepares and protects the United States outside of its borders. The Department of Homeland Security has more than 200,000 employees, which makes it the third largest cabinet department. The department has been separated into many new agencies, such as Immigration and Customs Enforcement, Citizenship and Immigration Services, Customs and Border Protection, Transportation, Security Administration, United States Coast Guard, and the United States Secret Service. The creation of the Department of Homeland Security has been the biggest governmental reorganization in American history and the creation of the newest agencies since the National Security Act of 1947 under Harry Truman. The headquarters of the Department of Homeland Security is located in Washington, D.C. Some of the most recent things that the Department of Homeland Security has recently done are adding more security to airports and important areas around the United States. Along with this, the Department of Homeland Security has made a plan called the Secure Border Initiative. This multi-year plan is meant to secure the United States border and decrease the number of immigrants across the border. This plan is made up of more agents along the border and a systematic upgrade of security of the border by using UAVs, cameras, and fencing off the areas most exploited. Along with this addition to our border, the Department of Homeland Security has also added a system used as an advisory system to warn citizens on the terrorism threats by using a color-coded system. The new system was used mainly to inform the public that at any time a terrorist attack can occur on the people of the United States and that they should fly on a plane at their own risk. Because of all the new creations and new agencies that the Department of Homeland Security has created, it has led to a more jobs being available and more security within the United States. The Department of Homeland Security has made its goals very clear and up to this day has improved and prevented many terrorist threats and, and saved the lives of countless American citizens.